السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته محاضرتنا في اليوم هي الباور سيستم ستيبلتي بارت 1 للطلاب مرحلة رابعة جامعة تكنولوجية قسم هندسة الميكانيك فرع الطاقة والطاقات المتجددة نلقيها على يسارعكم دكتور رسام First of all let's define the stability and we see the type of the stability uh, The stability استقراري هي قدرة النظام أن يصل إلى النورمال أو الستيبل كونديشن بافتر بينج ستيبلز بعد حدوث عطاء سو ذا ستيبلتي بروبلم از كونسيرت وذ ذا بيهيفر اوف سايكروس ماشين اوكي افتر ا ديستربنس اندر ستيبل كونديشن سو ذا سيستم ستيز ان سايكروس سو وي هاف ثري تايبس اوف سايكروس سايكروس ستيبلتي عندنا ثلاث انواع من الاستقلاليه المتزامنه We have the steady state stability and transient stability and dynamic stability. راح نشوف شو نشوف كل واحدة من عندها. So the steady state stability here refers to the ability of the power system. يعني قدرة المنظومة الكهربائية to regain synchronism with the zone مالتها after small and slow disturbance. بعد حدوث عطل صغير أو بطيء. Such as gradual power changing, يعني تغير بالقدرة بشكل تدريجي. While the transient stability is the ability of the system, قدرة النظام to regain synchronism after large disturbance. يعني steady state stability يحدث عطل small صغير بينما ال transient stability يحدث عطل كبير. مثلا Such as sudden change in the large loads. يعني يصير عندنا عطال مفاجئة بالأحمال العالية. Line switching operation. هذا النوع الثاني من the large disturbance. Fault on the system. عطال على المنظومة. Sudden, sudden outage of a line. يعني من يصير عندك عطال كهربائي بالبيت أو line يوقع فجأة. Or loss of excitation. اوكي هذني الانواع كلهن شنو هي عباره عن لارج ديستربنس اللي هي متعلقه بمن بالترانزيت ستيبلتي بينما الستيد ستيت ستيبلتي هي شنو هي اعطال صغيره تحدث بالمنظومه تشير الى الستيد ستيت ستيبلتي ذا لاست تايب اوف دايناميك ستيبلتي از ا كونسيرت ويز سمول ديستربنس Lasting for a times of order, يعني يحدث with a small disturbance and with a period of the time, يعني for example, من ten to thirty seconds, or من أربعة من four to ten seconds. Okay, هذا dynamic disturbance. So the stability limit and the steady state stability limit. So the stability limit means the maximum power that can be transferred. In the network, يعني عندنا أعظم قدرة ممكن أن ننقلها خلال الشبكة بين من بين sources and بين loads. Okay, عندنا أعظم شنو أعظم قدرة ممكن أن تنتقل بالشبكة بين المصادر بين الأحمال without loss of synchronism. Okay, the steady state stability limit is the maximum power. Okay, that can be transferred. هم الأعظم قدرة ممكن ننقلها Without, see here, without the system become unstable, بدون أن يصبح النظام غير مستقر. When the load is increased, عندما الأحمال تزداد gradually under steady state condition, a transient stability limit is the maximum power that can be transferred without the system becoming unstable when a sudden or large disturbance occur. Okay, so infinite bus power. System or infinite pass. It is the system of constant voltage, يعني voltage ثابتة and constant frequency. After the third, regardless of the load. And in one another, physically it is not possible to have a perfect infinite pass. So an infinite pass is ideal voltage source. Okay. So the infinite pass, this is really important, is the ideal voltage source. So, 
Let's define the power curve and how we are going to know this power curve, power angle curve. So from this figure, so we have the synchronous machine connected to the infinite bus with a transmission line, okay? So with the reactance X of L. So let's assume that the resistance and the capacitance, capacitance of the line are magnetic. So to make this as uh, uh, infinite bus, so we, we're going to make this circuit as the equivalent circuit. So we transfer the E with the XD, right? This is to represent synchronous transit uh, of the machine. And this is to represent the transmission line of the reactors of the transmission line. And this is to represent the synchronous transit reactors of the machine, okay? Synchronous machine. While this is to represent the infinite box. So this is simple circuit. So <clears throat> from the simple circuit, so we are going to uh, uh, drive the complex power to buy the generator to the system. Okay, from the generator to the system. So from this power, we know this power. Okay, so this is the current and this is the voltage. This is conjugate current. So the conjugate current of the of the system of the system. So we have this current here, right? So this voltage minus the voltage over this reactance, you will find the current. So this voltage with the delta minus V to the zero because the ideal without angle. And this is for the total uh, <coughs> reactance of the system. So this is the this is the current. Okay, this is the conjugate current. And then this is, we are assuming this is with X, and just we put this in X, and we got, we are going to separate this part. This is X, okay? So we're gonna separate this part to this part, okay? After conjugate is gonna change this negative to the positive, and you have this now, just separated, and then, uh, move the 90 to the up in the division so the angle is subtract right so delta minus 90 plus j v this v is going to be go here and go here so we have v here and v square here and this is the x okay <clears throat> and then open this we're going to open this so the magnitude cosine delta minus 90 plus j magnitude sine j delta minus and handle hadi we're gonna analyze this to get this try with this try okay بعد ما حللناها راح نعزل ال 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 conjugate على ال ال ركتا ال imaginary على جهة والريال على جهة فصارت عندي هاي المعادلة هذا الريال بارت وهذا الإيماجيناري بارت طبعا هو هذا الدرايف ما is not required for you but I want you to understand it so رح ناخذ ال 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 الريال بارت هذا الريال بارت اوكي so هذا الريال بارت فبي اي رح كافئ لي ريال بارت اللي هي V E V absolute E absolute V over X sine delta so on the B maximum so the real power transfer to the system هذا real power transfer to the system and هذه تمثل ال B maximum of the real power to the transfer to the system <coughs> so here when the maximum power to the state occur when delta 90 and the uh, delta is 90. Okay, and the maximum power. We will see it in the figure. So the graphical. This is graphical. This is for generator, and this is for motor. It's the opposite. Okay. So this is the cosine. You know the wave. It starts 0, 90, and 180. So at 90, here the delta is the maximum power uh, represent, and so the graphical represents 
is PE real power and the load angle and both this parameter is called the power angle curve uh, and then now is it clear for you what does it mean power angle curve okay so the x axis is a delta and real power is uh, uh, real power transfer to the system is uh, y axis so at the at the delta 190 as this said note okay so it's going to be uh, give us the b maximum for the motor is the opposite so the negative side 0 minus 90 minus 180 so here the p maximum is not going to change because the the y axis if is gone down or up is just the negative and we have uh, dealing with the power so it's uh, the same at minus 90 or 90 for the generator and minus, minus 90 for the motor okay so here note said the maximum power like we were when the delta 90 which is right and the b maximum is called the steady state uh, uh, steady state limit the p maximum uh, the that model steady state and the total x uh, x it method the uh, reactants mal uh, transmission line and mal uh, cyclonic machine um, uh, between two voltage source which is v the infinite bus and e is the cyclonic machine uh, and it's called this is x is called transfer reactance okay so now the steady state stable criterion so the the the, the, the partial division or the mushtaqal uh, ula power to the angle is called the synchronizing power coefficient or electrical stiffness of the synchronous machine so in general we have two two two, two things so the system in the manzuma tkun mustaqirra fa hadhi rate larger than zero akbar min sifr lil motor el delta akbar min zero and asghar min 90 baynama lil generator baynama lil motor delta akbar min minus 90 and asghar min zero so hai endama tkun sura amma el manzuma is stable baynama min tkun steady state stability limits reach to the zero hai manzuma tawsal lil sifr okay يعني معناها وصلنا الى steady state stability للمنظومة if هذا احنا عندنا ثلاث حالات اما large او zero او small than zero فمن يكون small than zero اذا system unstable يعني اذا اكبر system stable اذا اصغر system unstable اذا وصل مرحلة zero يعني معناها steady state stability لزم uh, limit reach to the equal zero of the of this coefficient. Let's take an example and make this is applying how you are calculated. So the one line diagram of the port system shown in figure, uh, the color figure, was about a synchronous synchronous generator connected with infinite bus between transmission line. Okay. Read next the power angle equation for the system. So the power equation, power angle equation, هذه المعادلة. Okay. So E read V and X equivalent. E هي منطقة 1.22 and V واحد للinfinite bus and X equivalent هي مجموع ال X D and X L X D. Well, the machine is 0.5 plus XL the transmission line which is the value of 0.5 let's see here you will get the electrical power equation the maximum which is 1.22 this is a simple example example 2 which is the figure below shows as a single line diagram of 3 phase 60 hertz synchronous generator connected through transformer and very transmission line to infinite bus uh, all reactors are given in bare units on the common system base if the infinite bus receives a one bare, bare unit real power and 
954 factor lag determine the internal voltage of the generator which is this this internal voltage and the second thing is the equation for the electrical power delivery by the generator versus in power angle and now the circuit will be the circuit with the parameter and how will equivalent and show how will equivalent call the generator and the transformer call the transmission line and how will have a certain name كل الرياكتنس موجودة بالمنظومة هذه هذني بالتوازي اوكي وهاي بالتوالي اذا نشوف هذني بالتوازي 0.2 ملتبلاي هاي 0.2 تبلاي 0.3 وشي هذا هذني 0.3 بلس هذا ويا هذي بالتوالي تطلع لك الاكس كوفلنت اللي هي قيمتها 0.5 احنا نريد نحسب اي طبعا الاي للمنظومه هذا هي عباره عن في بلس جي اكس كوفلنت اي صحيح فالاكس كوفلنت حسبناها اللي هي هذه الفي اي عندنا قيمتها واحد بالزاويه زيرو للانفينيت باس وقال اي شلون الاي نحسبها مطينا معلومات على الانفينيت باس اللي هي بي اوفر هذه اللي بي يقول في اي كوساين ثيتا الاي هو عبارة عن بي اوفر في كوساين ثيتا كوساين ثيتا اللي هي باور فاكتر بوينت ناين الفي اللي هي قيمتها واحد الباور مطيناها واحد باليونت نحسب الاي بعدين نحسب الانجل مالته كوساين انفرس بوينت ناين فايف نعطيك الانجل اللي هي ثيتا مال التيار بما انه هي لاك فاصير ماينس فمن طلع عندي التيار اوكي يعني عوضها بهاي المعادله راح نقدر نحسب الاي كما بالاتي نشوف هاي المعادله مالتك البي عندك الكوفلنت عندك التيار حسبت هذا عوض راح تطلع لك البي هذا المطلب الاول المطلب الثاني تريد المعادله مال الريال باور فعندك اي عندك في عندك اكس كوفلنت ساين دلتا تعوض بهذا القيم تطلع لك المعادله الثانيه اتمنى ان استفدتوا من هاي المحاضره اذا عندكم اي سؤال اي استفسار رجاء اتصلوا بي شكرا جزيلا